You've heard of right to education, your right to equality, expression, religion and more. But have you ever heard of your right to be forgotten? You heard that right. This has been the hot topic of discussion in recent times after Ashutosh Kaushik, a former reality TV star and winner of Big Boss 2008 and MTV Roadies Season 5, approached the Delhi High Court with a plea that his videos, photographs and articles be removed from the internet, citing his right to be forgotten. We explained what this right is and if you can really be forgotten. It allows a person to erase all private information off the internet. Six petitions by persons wanting to erase themselves from the internet are being heard by the Delhi High Court at present and the judgment is expected to remove the cobwebs around such cases. People usually intend to evoke this to erase all private information, court hearings, news reports and more about themselves. They basically want to be forgotten on the internet, especially for search results that continue to tarnish their reputation by cropping up time and again. The right to be forgotten falls under the purview of an individual's right to privacy which is governed by the Personal Data Protection Bill of 2019, which is yet to be passed by the Parliament. The PDP Bill aims to provide provisions for the protection of the personal data of individuals. According to the right to be forgotten, users can de-link, limit, delete or correct the disclosure of their personal information held by different bodies like the state or companies or juristic entities or even individuals. But can you erase any information about yourself as you please? Not really. The sensitivity of this said personal data will be determined by a body called Data Protection Authority and only after their green signal will requests for erasure be carried out. While accessing the request, the DPA authorized officer will need to examine the sensitivity, the scale of disclosure, degree of accessibility sought to be restricted, role of the data principle in public life and the nature of the disclosure, among some other variables. While several have petitioned for it, only a few have gotten some respite. In May 2019, Justice Pratibha M. Singh of the Delhi High Court, dealing with a civil suit seeking removal of certain news reports on Me Too allegations against the managing director of a media house, said that the right to be forgotten and right to be left alone are inherent aspects of the right to privacy and restrained republication of these news reports. In April 2021, a woman sought the removal of a matrimonial dispute related information. The court ruled in her favour, but Google is now challenging the decision. On that note, Google in 2019 won a landmark case in the European Union's top court related to the right to be forgotten. So, let's take a look at it. The European Union has one of the strongest laws on this. The General Data Protection Regulation, that is the GDPR, adopted by the European Union in 2018, lays out the circumstances under which the right applies. Each request is evaluated individually for its merits. Incorrect, misleading, excessive or irrelevant or unlawfully processed information can be removed on request. After a dispute between Google and a French privacy regulator, European Union's top court ruled that Google does not have to apply the right to be forgotten globally. It means the firm only needs to remove links from its search results in Europe and not elsewhere after receiving an appropriate request. In the international domain too, there has been controversy about this law. These are mainly because there continue to exist concerns about its impact on the right to expression, its relationship with privacy and whether such mechanisms would decrease the quality of the internet through censorship. 